Yeah, we're on Harris Street and the road is still closed. Uh, people still obviously caution to go back into their homes, um, but we are in a race against time here in Port Orchard because that next system is going to be moving through today, although we're already seeing the rain. We are expecting a windstorm with gusts 65 miles per hour potentially and see this look roads closed. People are still going by, so hopefully that's a utility crew there. Anyway, um, let's get to what the National Weather Service has said here. So uh, they're saying Tuesday's tornado was an EF2. So that's with winds 120 to 130 miles an hour. It traveled nearly a mile and a half and was about 300 yards wide. There are no reports, though, of serious injuries, which is great news. But Kitsap County says at least 250 homes were damaged. A team of first responders are out assessing the damage to homes and buildings. So the yellow means limited entry. Red means it's not safe to go in in some spots where they have the green light to work. They're working around the clock. So what's really nice is that many Port Orchard businesses are that sell building supplies are donating as much as they can uh, to the rebuilding effort and the owners say that they just want to help out uh, their neighbors. And right now you're taking a live look at the tree that we were talking about yesterday on Harris Street that has fallen and I believe there's two trees on this home here just so, so sad and hopefully everyone can kind of get everything cleaned up before the winds really whip 